silly rabbits, sugar isn't for kids. This is commentary from James Brown. A bill approved by Denver City Council is raising some eyebrows. If this bill becomes law, sugary drinks like soda or juice will no longer be the initial option for kids' meals at restaurants. Water or unflavored milk or milk substitutes will be offered instead. Menus will have to be adjusted by next July. Bill sponsor in Denver Councilman Chris Hines says, we have an obesity epidemic. We have a diabetes epidemic. So let's set up our kids for success. Let's make sure they can focus on learning instead of being worried about the health complications so early in their lives. I agree with him. I believe we should all have less sugar in our lives and avoid giving so much sugar to kids so early and so often. There are tons of ill effects. But I hate this method. It smells of virtue signaling. Enforcing this kind of thing seems impossible. What are you going to do? Have some police or some newfangled agency bust into fast food places and inspect kids' meals? That seems like a waste of money and energy. And what about freedom of choice? As a parent, you should retain the right to raise your child as you wish, as long as you're not endangering their lives. And whether we like this or not, calling this endangerment is a stretch. Government should use its bully pulpit to educate, not make endless, pointless, toothless culture war edicts. For these reasons, and so many more, I don't want government anywhere near sugary drinks. On that note, I'm James Brown, and as always, be well.